Hey guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I am so excited to release this video today. It is going to be my room tour finally. I always get requested this video from you guys every single time I ask you guys what content you guys would like to see and I thought that I would kind of just do a YouTube video on it because I wanted to uh, do like an in-depth talk through video and let you guys know where I got everything from. I will also have the links to everything that I got in my room and I will try and find alternatives if they're not available. Um, some of the clips that I recorded were pre-recorded before because I did try and attempt it. Uh, so I'm just going to include a, some clips which will show you guys an update of what I've changed around in the room and kind of how it's come together as well. So enjoy! So the first thing that we've got in my room is my pride and joy, my coat rack. I absolutely love this coat rack and it's probably got about 25 or 30 coats on this. This coat rack, I got it from a brand called Habitat and I actually purchased it off Argus, I think. So I'm going to try and find the link and link it in the description box below. And then underneath there, I just put like my my shoes, which I usually wear like day to day basis. And then next we've got my chest of drawer, which is from Ikea. And this actually took forever to build. Um, it was, I think it's called the Hermes range or something. Or no, actually the Hemnes, Hemnes, something like that. But and the glass top that's on top of there is actually separate so you could also purchase that from ikea and and the next thing that we've got is the mirror that sits on top and that is also from ikea those light bulbs that sit on top of the mirror are from poundland and i think i got those like about two or three years ago for some decor stuff that i was doing and i just basically added it to the room um this vase over here is also from Ikea, so it, was, it had a cork inside it, so it was one of those cork vases. Um, those feathers are from a local craft shop. Um, dried flowers, this is from B&M. And then over here we have a little tray which holds one of my candles and a reed diffuser. This tray is actually from eBay and I'm going to try and find the link of it. This is from a Decennio and I kind of just put it there because I like the way it looks and then the next corner that we have is basically a little chair which has a lamp there um, the chair is from eBay as well and I'm going to try and find the link that cushion there is from Primark and then the next part of the room is my bed a lot of you have been asking where my bed is from. This is from a local, I wouldn't say local, but like um, one of those kind of Asian stores that do beds. And the reason why I went to go and get one of the beds from there is because the quality of their beds are so, so much better than like going to dreams and buying it. So basically I got this customized to kind of fit the, the room and stuff and yeah so those cushions these two are from matalon these are from denelm and the last two are also from denelm the put pillows but the covers are from Shein. the bed set is from primark and that throw is from ikea these frames up here are from decennio so i ordered the gold frames with the print inside so uh, moving on to this corner of the room, um, that mirror right there is where I take all of my Instagram selfies. Um, that one is also from Ikea and I think it was about £45, just slightly bigger than the one that sits on top of my dresser. Um, that is actually a stool as well from Ikea, that rug is also from Ikea and that lamp. <laughs> Basically guys, my whole room furniture is from Ikea. Um, that lamp was actually meant to be temporary and it is temporary at the moment but I am gonna kind of replace it soon when I find something that catches my eye and where the YSL bag is right now there was actually supposed to be a plant right there which I now basically don't have because it died on me and I'm not replacing it because I'm not a good plant mother I know I know then moving on to this side of the room I have my IKEA wardrobe here um, this I have had for like nine or 10 years probably. And it was actually a deep brown color, so you could see it there, which 
I didn't paint. Um, I painted this whole wardrobe using furniture paint just to give it that white look. And I just thought that instead of spending money on replacing all of the doors, I'd rather just paint it and see how long that lasts me and then probably go and spend some money in replacing them later. I then have these IKEA storage boxes on top just to kind of store away the junk. So, and over here I have my a little cult rack thing which has all of my robes. So moving on from this corner, over here we have this big clock which is on my chest of drawer a chest of drawer? A uh, chimney breast. Um, this is from Denelm, so I'm going to try and find a link for that. So I'm just going to quickly give you guys a overview of how it looks from this angle. Try not to get into it. So yeah, basically that's that. So I thought I'd show you guys my outfit today. My top is from River Island, trousers from ASOS, loafers from Primark. And this was the section that I wanted to basically update you guys on. My plant is actually back. My mom basically revived it, but this part is dead. So RIP on that. I hopefully, well, I hope that I will not kill this again. This is the second plant guys. Um, I also managed to change the lamp, well, semi-change the lamp. This is a lamp which I got from a vintage store. And what I like about it is this. So it moves about. Um, but yeah, I'm looking for like a lamp shade to kind of go on top of that. And yeah, so that's this section done. And this is the corner that I also changed up. Well, not really changed up too much. But what I did was just change the the tray that I had there and added a few perfumes which are light and neutral colored which kind of goes with the room really nicely I also forgot to tell you guys that that lamp is also from Ikea and these are the perfumes this is from Desenio I probably have already mentioned and this is where I've put the other tray so it's still got my candle and diffuser and everything's just like that so that has basically come to the end of my room tour um let me know if you guys enjoyed watching this video um yeah i really enjoyed filming this so see you guys next time bye